What's going on everybody? My name is Bobby and I'm just another reactor here on YouTube and today I'm going to be reacting to Band Maiko. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right and this is called Sacred Maiko Lips. I don't know if it's Band Maiko or Mako. See, Secret Mako Lips. <laughs> Whatever it's called, let me know in the comments because I'm not sure. But this is the official music video. And before I get to this reaction, I just want to remind y'all to please subscribe to my channel. And please like this video. And if you care to support my channel, there's a PayPal link in the description. Or you can leave a tip through the Brave browser, which is a cryptocurrency browser. And you can even donate through the Cash App using my email address, which is also in the description below. But donations to my channel are not necessary. They're not required. You can watch my videos for free, but any support for my channel is greatly appreciated. Now this song here, I believe I've gotten a few requests for it in some of my older bandmade reactions, maybe a few requests in my later bandmade reactions, but I do know that this is a, a, a what do you call it, a subunit of bandmade is what it says here. Uh, so. Uh, I just, like I said, I'm not sure if it's pronounced like Maid, Mako, or just Maiko, like a, a different Japanese word. I'm just not sure. But anyway, I looked up some information on this because I wasn't sure why they used this name, even though I knew it was Band Maid. Uh, and it says here on the Band Maiko wiki fandom that, uh, Ban Maiko or Mako is a subunit of Bandmaid that first appeared as an April Fool's Day prank on April 1st, 2018. The prank had a good reception from the fans and as a result they returned on April 1st, 2019, releasing their first mini album. And then it says the concept behind it is summed up as Maiko times Hard Rock. For their songs, they brought out traditional Japanese instruments to create a festive and elegant Kyoto-inspired sense of style. The members wear maiko, so I guess that's a form of dress, which when I saw the thumbnail, I was thinking it, they looked like they're dressed as geishas, because I know what a geisha is, sort of. Uh, and it says that the members wear maiko, and then in parentheses, Apprentice Geisha outfits. Not sure what they mean by Apprentice Geisha. And their lyrics are based on the Kyoto dialect. So Kyoto, I guess that's a form of a Japanese language. I'm not sure of that either. Uh, so anyway, they were meant to release something new on April 1st, 2020. But of course it was cancelled due to the stupid pandemic. So anyway, uh, I just thought that was interesting, and I'm sure most of y'all already knew this stuff, but for those of you that didn't, there it was. Uh, so anyway, I don't really know much about the band Mako or Maiko stuff. Uh, I don't know if it's still going to be hard rock or heavy, or because they're using Japanese instruments and to create a festive elegant Kyoto inspired sense of style. Maybe it's going to be more laid back, more Japanese music sounding. I'm just not sure, but we'll find out. So anyway, without further ado, this is my reaction to Ben Mako or Maiko and the song Secret Maiko Lips. I'll just keep saying Maiko. <laughs> Sounds like a mandolin.
I just had to stop it there. This sounds awesome. So the beginning of saying sounds like a mandolin. Uh, just kind of sounded almost to me like the the mandolin that's played in the uh, uh, Battle of Evermore by Led Zeppelin, which ironically uh, uh, Jimmy Page uh, really liked uh, Akane's drumming. But anyway, uh, yeah, that sounded really cool at the beginning. You know, did have that kind of Japanese music style kind of vibe to it. But man, then it just kicked in with the heavy and Oh man, it sounds great. The drumming sounds awesome. Misa's bass sounds great. Uh, it's definitely bandmate. I can tell Saiki's voice right off the bat. You know, and also uh, Miku with her Zemitis guitar. I mean, that's unmistakable. So yeah, this this just sounds awesome. And man, just the whole look of it too looks really cool. Them, instead of dressed like maids like they normally are, dressed as geishas just really cool really cool video really badass song so far and oh that bass sound <laughs> I just had to pause it again. This kicks ass. Uh, again, the whole, you know, geisha look just looks really cool. I, the, I like all the colors of it, just the way they're made up. Saiki, she just looks different to me. I'm, I'm just used to that other outfit she wears. With, I think it's with that bow in her head or something like that. But this sounds really awesome. And then Konami kicking ass on that guitar solo. What else can I say about that?
Well, that was Dan Maiko with Secret Maiko Lips, and that was just awesome. Uh, once again, the video looked great. Uh, their outfits, all the color, the makeup on their face, uh, just really embracing that geisha style that they did there. Uh, really cool. And again, also Konami just kicking ass on that guitar solo. The bass sound on this was just outstanding. Misa is a great bass player. I really like the way she plays. And I've, I've said this before, but I know she's influenced by a lot of uh, uh, some of the 90s grunge bands and things like that. But man, she's she's got just that heavy, I call it a heavy metal bass sound. And her playing, she, she, can, she can jam with some good metal musicians and hold her own if she wanted to. You know, she, she's just a good, really good bass player. And Akane, great drummer also. Even Miku on the rhythm guitar just sounds great. I mean, she doesn't even have to play solos. She just sounds good. The whole band overall, vocals, everything sounds amazing. Uh, that was just a cool song. The Japanese instrumentation there, I recognize the sounds, but I'm not familiar with Japanese instruments, you know, and the awesome music that the Japanese people create with those instruments, but it sounded really cool in this song, and I just like the way it was integrated without being overbearing and, you know, just sounding kind of, you know, it could have been overdone and maybe sound a little corny, but they just did it perfectly. It sounded great, and this was a great song, and I... I saw, I think, one or two other Band My Eco videos, so I'm going to have to get to those soon. Let me know in the comments if you have one that you would like me to react to, uh, and I'll get to it as soon as I can. But anyway, that's my reaction, and I hope you all enjoyed it. And I just want to remind you all again to please subscribe to my channel, and please like this video. And if you care to support my channel, there's a PayPal link in the description, or you can leave a tip through the Brave browser which is a cryptocurrency browser. And you can even donate through the Cash App using my email address, which is also in the description below. But donations to my channel are not necessary. They're not required. You can watch my videos for free. But any support for my channel is greatly appreciated. Thank you all once again for watching my reaction to Ban Maiko, Secret Maiko Lips.